ever wondered what the designer edition of the Bellroy products look like? Well, I have a designer edition version of the Slim Sleeve right here. So if you have any questions about wallets, uh, want to know what's going on in the world of it, you can always go, you can always go to Walletopia.info and sign up there. Great place to go, no issues. Uh, we'd love to have you over there. But now, let's get into this. Unlike their normal products, which come in a very consistent packaging, the designer edition products come in this very nice uh, cardboard layout, which is fairly clever. It has this unhook clip here. We open it up in four pieces. And here we have the presentation, which is nice, as well as uh, it talks about the product here specifically. Uh, they're really, in, they're really uh, emphasizing the quality of the material, the uh, different construction methods they use. It's all really based around the luxury of the product. So let's uh, take this very nice, firm, plasticky parchment off. It's not your typical paper. And take a look at this. This particular color caught my eye. This is the Galaxy Gray. Kind of looks bluish gray to me, but it is uh, a design from a limited run uh, print from an artist, a French artist called Elsa Balk. And so this is just a, a neat color, neat design, feels fantastic, and has some great features, of course, if you're familiar with the slim sleeve. It's uh, one of its main features is this pull strap that it has. So it's got uh, some good information here. Get a quick look at it here. And there are some differences between this and the normal slim sleeve. Nice, nice looking wallet. All right, now onto the feature review, boy. Yeah, we have some bling here. This is <laughs> this is bling, so let's bring it on. The designer edition of the Bellroy Slim Sleeve, and really all the designer edition versions of their wallets, come with the Bellroy logo imprinted on the front. There are no specific features on the exterior of the wallet, so if we move on to the interior, we can see that they have the Bellroy name, as well as the designer edition notation here, imprinted in the leather. The characterizations of the leather also carry all the way through it. And uh, you'll notice that on the left-hand side, we have one card slot here. And the single card slot is uh, similar but different in layout than the normal slim sleeve. And we have another card slot here on the left-hand rear. On the right-hand side, it's similar but different. We have a card slot here at the top, but instead of another card slot just as a card slot, and this over here is typically where you would put your cash folded over once, which is very nice. You put your kind of archive cards into here in this pull strap. And that pull strap you know, gives you quick access, but also allows you to put more cards over here for storage. And that is a quick review of the features of the Bilroy Designer Edition Slim Sleeve Wallet. Now into the card and cash insertion test. Now the company says it can hold four to 12 cards plus cash. We put six in here, which is I think about the perfect number. I think if you're a minimalist, about four, six is really good uh, before it starts stretching over time. We had three slips of cash in there, fold it over once, which is nice. For foreign currencies, you would have to fold it over twice to make it work. And they talk about folding it over in thirds, but nobody does that, that takes way too much time. Now, from a quality perspective, this is designed in Australia. It's made in India, made from environmentally certified top grain Nubuck leather, leather, Nubuck, and it's veg tan. Nubuck is kind of like a suede. So that's why it kind of has this, uh, not just soft, but uh, a kind of a semi furriness to it. It feels really good. And there's no RFID in this. <laughs> exactly, fantastic. Now, this pull strap here, let's take a look, is made out of leather. And what uh, is nice about this is that, of course, leather lasts a lot longer and than, than uh, nylon, maybe. I mean, it could be argued depending on the quality of that. Um, what is nice here is, is that it does have this burnishing treatment on the very end. So the edges here, instead of being folded over, are burnished and they're painted. And so it's a painted treatment that they have here, which gives it quite a nice look. 
Now you can see from the video here, and this video is a breakdown of the regular slim, but you get a feel for the uh, how they put this wallet together. So again, this is an excellent video that really provides good education from a company on how they construct their wallets. And you really don't find that information very often from other companies of this particular size. Now the product itself costs $139. It is on the higher end. It is their designer edition. It does have higher end leather. It has uh, you know specialized treatment on here. You will not find this design on any of their other normal wallets, obviously, but this color is on their designer edition. Uh, it is a very easy wallet to use overall, but putting cash in folded over more than once, even if it's pulled over, folded over once, begins to stick out a bit, but it doesn't really interfere with the spine, so closing it is not a problem. And, and I really like it because it actually provides a way to grasp the bills. If it was in there all the way, you wouldn't be able to grasp the bills as easily. The pull strap handle is designed, designed just enough to poke out so that you can grab it, but not so much more that it actually becomes a nuisance and it really becomes a floppy and difficult. It measures 3.74 by 3.15 by 0.4. It is slightly larger than the regular slim sleeve, but that's really due to the leather choice here, which is great. Um, it weighs 37 grams, which again, there's no RFID material in this, there's no metal, nothing, and so that is all leather. And I really love the look and feel of this. It really is neat. Now the slim sleeve is one of my personal favorites. I, I carry tested it. Uh, you can see that video, it's down in the notes. It's probably up here as well. And I really liked it. They all have three year warranties on their products for defects and materials. It's just a, a great design. They really hit it out of the ballpark with this one. Now, Bellroy themselves, they're a certified B Corporation that meets the highest standards of verified social, environmental performance, public transparency, and legal accountability, where they where they balance profits and purpose. You know, of course they want to make money, but they want to make sure that they're doing it in a very conscientious way. They're based in Australia and they were founded in 2010. Now on to the final score. For quality of four, price a two, features a four, usability of four, and perception of four. That gives us a final score of 36 out of 50. Thanks for watching uh, the Designer Edition. If you can afford it, if you can justify it, it's actually a great wallet. Thanks for watching. See you again. Bye.